Types of data. Data can be classified as publicly available data, confidential data, and restricted or private data. When data is publicly available to all, it is known as publicly available data. Example, a bank's balance sheets and insurance policy details, a government's tender notices and job posts held by authorities. When data is available only to the people involved in a process or an organisation, in other words, it is restricted from unauthorised access, it is called confidential data. Example, a manufacturing company's market forecast data, test cases and standards, a bank's customer data consisting of the addresses and phone numbers, or a government's sensitive scientific and medical research data. When the data is super sensitive, in other words, leakage may lead to serious issues, it is known as restricted or private data. Example, a company's system designs and trade secrets, financial account PIN numbers, an email password, personal reports or medical reports of a person. Having seen the different types of data sets that are nothing but information, what is the need for information security? What if a credit card PIN becomes available for everyone? What if the number of missiles held by a nation is known worldwide? What if the system design and test case for a new product of a company is accessible by their competitor? And what if a tender quotation of all the applicants is accessible by all the other applicants? Do you think it is good to go about without securing this information? Of course not! Let us now get into information security.